Christopher, will you take Sophie to be your wife? Will you love her, comfort her, honour and protect her for the sake of all others? Be faithful to her as long as you both shall live. I will. Sophie, will you take Christopher to be your husband? Will you love him, comfort him, honour and protect him, and forsaking all others, be faithful to him as long as you both shall live? I will. Sat right in this and tying our bands onto the pillow, thinking after all this time, 3,608 days to the date, I'd be marrying my best friend. I'm going from nervous, excited to sick to giddier than a kid at Christmas because I know I'm the luckiest man alive to be marrying you today. You have no idea what you truly do mean to me. I wish you could see yourself with my eyes to realise how special you are to me and our perfect son. I really do love you more than the moon and the stars, your husband to be. To my Chris, my best friend and my very, very soon to be husband. I am so proud of the man and dad you have become. I know my dad would have loved you and is looking down on us today celebrating me marrying that true Geordie gentleman. People make a lot of promises to one another on a day like today. I can't promise we won't have downs. I can't promise we won't have tears, but I can promise you this, those tears will dry quicker when we cry them together. Those downs will never feel as low as they did alone, and that will always love you with my whole heart, and that will be the easiest thing I will ever have to do. like all to raise a glass for the people that can't be with us to share the day but one man in particular Mike I really do wish we had have met but from what I do know I know you're up there looking down enjoying the day as much as we are from all of us to Mike my wife, Sophie Lana Fisher. If I knew marrying you would feel this good, I wouldn't have made you wait so long. You truly are my world, and with Teddy, you do completely. <laughs> 